warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Hello everyone, I'm Risti from APRL Class G. Here I will explain topic of philosophy, namely logic as a scientific thinking and various kind of philosophical division. Logic comes from the ancient Greek word or logos, which means the result of reasoning expressed through word and expressed in language. Logic is a branch of philosophy as a science. Logic is called logic episteme or Latin logica scientia or the science of logic or science, which study the ability to change strike, purchase, and orderly. Sign here refers to the rational ability to know and skill refers to the ability of the mind to put knowledge into action. The logical word used can be interpreted with sense. Logic is a sense whose material object is thinking by reasoning and the formal object of logic is reasoning in terms of accuracy. Logic is a practical branch of philosophy. Practical here means logic can be practiced in everyday life. Logic was born together with the birth of philosophy in Greece. In a time, to put forth their true God and opinion, ancient Greek philosopher often tried to refuse other ideas by pointing out the fallacy of their reasoning. Logic is used to do the proof. Logic tells which form of inference that are valid or which are not. Traditionally, logic was studied as a branch of philosophy, but it can also be considered a branch of mathematics. Logic is unavoidable in the process of life seeking the truth. The concept of logical form is at the heart of logic. The concept states that the validity of an argument is determined by its logical form, not by its content. In the case, logic becomes a tool for analyzing argument, namely in the relationship between conclusion and evidence or evidence given or premises. Logic as a mean of scientific thinking is a pattern reasoning based on everyday life influenced by the natural environment. While scientific thinking is a pattern of reasoning based on certain ways, regularly and carefully, science is knowledge gained through method scientific. The proper implementation of scientific activity requires thinking that allows for regular research and broad-minded. Scientific thinking is logical and empirical thinking. Logic is logical and empirical is discussed in depth above the basis of justifiable fact. In addition to using reason to reflect, decide, and develop, Think scientific is the process of thinking or developing thinking systematically arranged based on scientific knowledge which exists. The means of scientific thinking are told for the scientific method in performing their function properly. So, the function of means scientific thinking is to help the process of the scientific method is in gaining knowledge or other theories. Means of thinking science are so released on the process of deductive logic and processes of inductive logic as the science which is a combination of deductive and inductive thinking. Next, we will talk about a various division of philosophy. The first is Epistemology. Epistemology is usually called a theory of knowledge, which generally talks about research, characteristic, and the truth of knowledge. The second is logic. As a branch of philosophy discuss the rules of thinking in order to draw conclusion correctly, logic can be defined as the science of drawing conclusion. The third is criticism of the science, also called the philosophy of science which is concerned with the theory of the division of knowledge, the method used in the science. Four is general metaphysics, also called ontology, as a philosophy that contains a part of the problem that talk about the most universal and universal principle. It's a branch of philosophy who we'll talk about existing. Five is metaphysic theology, which discusses the existence of the God, on the existence of God and regardless of religious belief. Six is anthropology, 
is a branch of philosophy that talks about human, what human nature is, what human are, and how nature relates to each other. Seven is cosmology is a branch of philosophy that conducts philosophical investigation of the things that are always discussed by the natural science. The study of cosmology is a philosophy of natural order. Eight is ethic. Ethic or philosophy as a branch of philosophy that discusses human action with an emphasis on good and bad characteristics on human. Nine is aesthetic. According to Semya One, explain that aesthetic as the study of natural beauty in art. The last is history of philosophy, a report of an event related to the philosophical talk.